All right, man. DJ Shark is out versus the Detroit Lions for the Seattle Seahawks. Um, so they'll be down DJ Shark as of right now. Um, you know, as of right now, I'm not sure if Josh Reynolds is going to play. I think he's questionable. So, uh, uh, you know, it's one of those games that, you know, Lions pose to win. And I just don't see how. No uh, St. Brown, no DeAndre Swift, no DJ Shark, uh, possibly no uh, Josh Reynolds. I mean, who are they throwing to? Cephas, uh, no Jamison Williams. So, I don't know. But, you know, DJ Shark out. He ain't been doing shit regardless, but damn. It was just time to, to grind. So, they signed, you know, uh, Dan Skipper and, and Dominic Eberly to the practice squad from the practice squad. Um, they evaluated Tom Kennedy, Maurice Alexander. I'm pretty sure one of them got to be moving up now. Um, so I don't know what happened with uh, – I thought Austin Sieber would be gone after missing those kicks. You know, I'm surprised he's still on the team. You know, so uh, Shark had a, 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 a work through an ankle injury. It's the same one he had surgically repaired last year. So once again – they price free agent pickup wasn't that expensive. DJ Shark um, is injured with the same ankle that that he has the end of the season last year. You know, you kind you kind of get where I'm going to going at with it. You get where I'm going at it with it. Come on. They keep bringing in guys that got pre existing injuries. Coming off hard, uh, coming off big injuries. Come on. And now you're starting to see it add all up. Now you're starting to see it all come down. Come on. What y'all expected? The Lions take all these risks on these injury-prone players, and then look what? Then the guys that's healthy in the NFL, you're going to miss games. You're going to get injured. Chance to say so. The chance to say so. So, at this point, um, you know, a must-win game turned to seem like they should be the underdogs. That's what it seemed like. They should be the underdogs. You know, I mean, they, yeah, they should, yeah, they should be the underdogs in this game. But you know, obviously, we are gonna have to wait and see. But you know, shark out. I mean, telling you, do a whole wide receiver core out. Come on. So now you depending on Cephas, Khalif, Raymond. Now you at where you was at last year. That quick, a strength became a weakness. That quick. This is why your, your risk can't be just injuries. That is why your risk just can't be injuries, bro. You got to take chance on dudes with character issues and shit like that. Everybody, you got a team full of, we being te technical, you got a team in an arena full of criminals. Everybody didn't commit a crime. Don't mean you can't change. Whole half the offensive line is out. Well, Jonah Jackson can't. Jonah Jackson and Big V out. My my Ross St. Brown is out. Josh Reynolds could be out. BJ Shark is out, which he seemed to be another dud by Brad Holmes, just as Tyrell Williams was last year. So. Come on. Come on. So John Kaminsky, Jonah Jackson, Austin Sieber, which he should be fucking cut. Sam Brown, DeAndre Swift, DJ Shark, all out. Questionable is Josh Reynolds. You know, look like Chris Ward, TJ Hawkinson, Bobby Price, and Ragnall will practice. I mean, they practice on Friday, so like they will play. Whole team out, basically. 
So I mean, don't su don't surprise don't surprise this team is cursed. It's cursed. You know, and in the two, think about your two top offensive weapons you brought in this offseason, both coming off major injuries. It's Shark and Jameson Wood. Just think about that for a minute. Come on. Then you had Jeff Okuda returning from a major injury. Romeo Cora changing from uh coming from a major injury. Josh Pascal, he had cancer. Then he had a sports hernia. Come on. Then you had Enzorki who had a back injury, a major back injury. Coming out of the year, he didn't even play full four. I didn't play a whole, he missed the whole season of college football. His back was fucked up, and you missed the whole prior season. And if it ain't a bigger, if it ain't a red flag, I, a bigger red flag, I don't know what it is. Now Tracy Walker off for the season. Monty Arari suffered a back injury. Come on. What, what are they doing? Jonah Jackson now. Frank, I mean, Frank Ragnar missed some time. Big V out. DeAndre Swift, you you know, he had one good ass game, then all of a sudden he already fucking injured. And they still depended on him. They still solely depended on DeAndre Swift. Come on, man. You couldn't write you you couldn't write you couldn't write a, a fantasy novelty like you know, like this one. You couldn't even write it. This this is bananas, bro. This is bananas. This is bananas. This is truly bananas. Truly is. But it is what it is. Let me know what you girls and guys think. Thumbs up the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel. And subscribe button, it's the bell icon button, hit on notification, increase your chance of notification. We go live with our video. Financially, want to support the channel? Cash up, Bella Sun, CJ Good 313, Limo CJ Good 313, PayPal link in the description. Hit the link tree, find me on Twitch, Twitter, Instagram, Spotify, Cash up, Limo, PayPal. Uh, appreciate the love and support. Let me know what you girls got in the comment section. But uh, we'll see. I'm, I anticipate Tommy, uh, uh, not Tommy, what's that man? Tom Kennedy, yeah. Should be uh, moving up into from the practice squad, but we had to wait and see. So, uh, let me know what you girls and guys think. Peace.